Hi friends and welcome to my closet. Woohoo! Everything behind this door is going to be cleaned the heck out today. We are doing a cleaning my closet video, you know, pretty self-explanatory. I'm just going to be getting rid of a crap ton of clothes and then I'm going to be selling them on my Depop. Um, sometime, you know, this week they'll be listed. I'll have my Depop in the description, of course, and anything that doesn't sell will just go to Goodwill. Yeah, I did one of these last year, actually, last spring, and I've done multiple of these in the past, and everybody loves a good cleaning my closet video for some reason. Lord knows why, but um, yeah. Also, before I get into this, I always get questions about this dress. Where did you get it? That dress is amazing, I want it. I thrifted it, like, five years ago and so i don't know what to tell you but you can always find the good threads at thrift stores okay so just keep your eye out for some nice grandma gowns all right guys so i'm going to show you what my current state of my closet looks like all right so you can just see for yourselves everything from that jacket on is finley's and everything from this over is mine so yeah pretty crazy stuff over here. I have a clothing problem. This is actually everything that's already starting to leave my closet that I've compiled over the past like few weeks. And then in here is just essential stuff like bras, underwear, pajamas, and socks and stuff like that. So we're not going to be dealing with that today, but I'm just going to be adding to that pile from everything up here. Oh yeah, let's get started. We have some work to do, okay? And at this side of the closet over here is where I have um, at the back like kind of dressy gowns. And this black dress is actually from a video that I filmed back in like 2014. <laughs> it was like some kind of Coachella inspired lookbook type thing. And I keep it for like gala reasons. So that will not be leaving the closet today. But this dress I also have kept for God knows how long and like, yes, it's pretty, but I literally never wear it. And you know, that is the, the main thing in this video. We are going to be getting rid of things that I cannot remember the last time I wore. I think the last time that I wore this was like to an all white party. It's like, when am I going to attend one of those again? All right, first piece is always the hardest. Is it? No, I don't think that's right. <laughs> this next dress I like to call my laundry dress. I always used to put this on when I was doing laundry. It's just, you know, nice and stretchy, airy to do stuff in. I think I thrifted this sometime last summer, but it's like, I don't need it anymore. This is now my laundry dress. Honestly, I wear this all the time, like at least freaking once a week. And this gets a lot of use in my closet, but this, no, no, no. This dress, I don't really know about. I am looking at it and I'm like, eh. I don't think it looks as good on me anymore as it used to. You know, it's hugging some places and sometimes we like it, but most of the time it's just, hmm, maybe not. Also, I have another black and white striped dress that's super tight, so I don't need to. This dress, okay, this was something that I wore to one of my friend's weddings and I do not think I've worn it ever again. Maybe on like a trip sometime, but other than that, man, I mean, she doesn't get much use we need to get rid of it but this is like a long beautiful kind of summery dress so uh, it's kind of hard to get rid of but at the same time it's like psh, who needs it this was the other black and white tight dress i was talking about we're gonna keep that one it's very form-fitting this is something that i'm looking at and i'm like keep or delete you know <laughs> i don't really know i'm gonna keep it right here on this hook and i'm gonna take a long look at it and I'm just gonna say, mm, no. Because anything that you really like in your closet, you should be like, yes, I'm keeping it. But if you're unsure, just get rid of it. I doubt you'll miss it. Now this is where we get to the part of the closet where I'm like, what the heck, why do you have so many? Jumpsuits. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And some of these are like long overalls, but some need to just hit the hay. This one, I believe I got this from Zara or something and like it's very funky and fun. Um, actually, funky is not the word. It's just form-fitting and nice for events that I would go to in LA, but I don't go to many of those anymore. And also my boobs explode out of this. And it's like, if I know that and I remember that, why keep it? And then the other one I'll get rid of is these long wild fox overalls. They're like baby pink and they're freaking cute, but they're just like more tight fitting than 
my regular overalls and I like my overalls to be like a little oversized, baggy, and these ones I've had since 2014, so they've lived their life with me for four years. Oh my God. These little romper things, I need to get rid of one of you. I think it's gonna be this red one because the shorts are so short and I don't really like things that expose my legs too much, you know? I'm like out of that phase of life. Okay, now we have four like tank kind of slip dresses. Well, these two are slips and these two are just regular cotton material, but I only need to keep one of these. So which one will it freaking be? If I'm gonna keep one little black dress, it's gonna be this one and I will rip myself of this one. This is more like lingerie. Like I literally found this in the lingerie department of a thrift store. And you know, when it was really trendy in LA to wear like slips and um, a white t-shirt underneath. Well, I don't need that anymore. Also, if I already have one little black dress, I don't need to. So I will rid myself of that. This is from Free People. I've liked it for a long time. Flying hanger, thank you very much. It is so hot in here. You know what? I'm gonna part ways, okay? Because I don't remember the last time I wore it. So that's the rule. I do like you though, we'll keep you. Okay, this dress my sister got me for Christmas. So for reasons, I will be keeping it, but I don't need two yellow velvety dresses. So this one I will be getting rid of. Any of my short girls watching this, this dress is incredible. It's like a mustard crushed velvet and it's from Reformation. And um, yeah, it's adorable, but I've definitely lived my life with it and I need it to go to another short girl. I'm 5'3", it's very short. You just need to know that before you go and check for it on my Depop, okay? These are three tank topped blue dresses. This one doesn't have anything really like to it that's like, oh yes, I love it. But it's so comfy and it's like racer back and just like a nice lounge dress. This one and this one, I'm like, Hmm, which one will go? I think this one, just cause like I'm looking at it and I'm like, mm, I don't like it as much as I used to. So we'll get rid of her. So long, farewell. Don't remember where I got you from, but all right. I turned the fan off so you guys wouldn't have to like hear it. And I'm kind of regretting my decision because it is so hot in here. Okay, these dresses, two like dark green kind of emeraldy dresses. This one's from Brandy Melville and it's, I've had it for way too long, honestly. Find yourself a new home. Actually, listen, I know I look good in dark green, but I don't think I need either of these. <laughs> This dress from Topshop. It's a corduroy number. I always have a hard time saying that word. Um, but yeah, it buttons in the front, but it does make my boobs kind of explode out of it. And just ill-fitting things like that. It's not in good taste for me to be keeping it. You know, sometimes I like to suck the girls in and be like, okay, you can make it. But once you have that like busting button, like even on this dress, I have one of those buttons that's kind of just busting. Um, because of my bust. <laughs> this dress, wow. She was saucy while I had her, the nice see-through cover band over the boobie. Um, I think that I need to say so long farewell. This is like, ow, I just hit my head. This is like a Romwe dress that has like cutouts on the um, shoulders and it's just tie-dye and nice, but like I've had it for probably four or five years at this point, so. Good riddance. Okay, this one is like a mustard silk, you know, dress that's long sleeve and nice. I wanna say this is from like Urban Outfitters or something, but honestly, dude, I have so many. I'm sure you can like just see from looking at my closet like this. I have so many pieces of yellow clothing. I don't need to keep it too much Lazy Oaf that I don't wear. And Lazy Oaf is seasonal, so it's like once they sell stuff, it doesn't really exist anymore on the shop. So if you have ever been looking for something covered in googly eyes. This is kind of like a long men's shirt type dress. Oh, now we have come to the portion I was waiting for. How many flannels do I have? Cause let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This one's like a cropped flannel that I really like from American Apparel. This one I wear all the time. It's kind of like worn and stuff, but I definitely need to get rid of both of these red ones. This one's from Wildflower and Element. They like did a clothing collab together, you know, like Wildflower cases, but I don't wear this and it has that nice little flannel happy face on the back. Freaking cute. Also this red one, I just like don't really wear anymore. 
I don't know, red doesn't look that great on me. So keep that in mind while you're watching this. I need to get rid of more red things that I never wear. Two turtlenecks, I wear both of those. I wear this. This is a no. This I got from, I wanna say Zara. It's so freaking cute, but I literally, I think I've worn it once. So that's when you know, it's gotta go. Oh, this feels so good, man. I hope I'm inspiring some of you to do the same because I feel like I'm just ripping off like 100 pounds right now of my life. Oh, this freaking top. It has deodorant stains right now, so I'm gonna have to definitely wash this before I sell it but this is like a tight top that has, it's from American Apparel, it has this kind of, I'll put a photo on the screen of me wearing it. It has like a choker to go around it, but it's just like really tight on my arms and it just needs a home with someone with skinnier arms. That's honestly the truth. Okay, this I definitely need to get rid of because even when I wear like a bralette under this, my boobs hang out of it. And so I need to give this to somebody who has smaller boobs. And I have another like tan cropped sweater that I love to just like layer over things sometimes. So I'll keep that one. This, I mean my brand, I need to keep it. These two, what I was just talking about, the red. I need to get rid of one, if not both of them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I consulted my brain and I've decided I need to get rid of both of them. <laughs> This, way too small for me. I think I got it at like the American Apparel Warehouse or something. Super cheap, super tiny, little crop top, and not big enough for les boobies. Okay, this I'm gonna send on to a new life. I have no use. Someone take it. Okay, we're almost through the shirts. We're getting a lot of freed up space in here, people. You see how, how much space we have between the hangers now? A lot more than we started with. Okay, now here we have four halter tops. And I don't need four, I need maybe two. So I'll keep this beloved one that my friend Sasha made me. Uh, actually, I think it was her mom. She personally crocheted this for me, incredible. And then this one is just like a black halter that I'll keep. But these two, um, they're both just like kind of tiny and have lived their life with me. Now for the really appalling part of this. I vividly remember having this same issue last summer when I filmed this. I said, who needs one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bodysuits. Not me. This, oh shit. This green one, I really like. I'll keep it. This red one's pretty saucy and I did get rid of those two red shirts before, so I'll keep that one for occasions. But this baby pink one, I'll get rid of her. This other baby pink one, it's very kind of more see-through. Not fully, but it's getting there and um, I'm gonna pass it on to somebody else. This lace one, I will keep. And then I need to get rid of also one of these striped ones. Honestly, I really like this green one, so I'll keep this one and get rid of this one. All right, that was easy. And now we're at the pants and skirt section of the closet, and I already kind of know which ones I'm gonna rid myself of, so give me a second here. These tie-dye pants, super groovy, good for festivals, stuff like that, but I don't really go to festivals anymore. And the last time I wore these was at Coachella 2014, so. Audios. Okay, these, I just got them. I literally just put them in a haul recently, but I was saying in it that I busted the button off of them and um, I should have gotten a medium instead of a small because of my thick thighs. And I didn't do that. And mm, you know, I should just get rid of them. And I also just got another like baby pink pair of pants that are a lot comfier. They're like silk and fun. I also put those in my last haul and I'm gonna keep those, get rid of these. That was a hard decision for me. Okay, these pants are from Wildflowers Grow Wild collection and I got them freaking years ago and I already have another pair of like black floral pants that I'm keeping, so those I will get rid of. Oh, it seems as though this dress has fallen from a hanger and I didn't realize until just now. So, you know, if it fell off the hanger, that means it probably wants to leave my closet, so. Adios. Also, this skirt, I remember debating last summer if I was going to get rid of this. It reminds me of like a teacher's skirt or like a little schoolgirl skirt, but longer and more proper. Um, I need to get rid of it because I never freaking wear it, man. And then these two skirts are just like circle skirts that I literally, I don't wear those anymore at all, so. Moving on, shall I show you the final product, the final damage that was done? Because we freed up a lot, people. This is what's gonna go onto the old Depop this week. Wow, iconic. As well as all of this, which I didn't show you, but I've already been getting rid of all of this. In this pile, just to name a couple of things, I have my old Mod Sun hoodie 
tie-dye I've just like had for so long and I know he doesn't sell these anymore I had one girl message me and be like can I buy that and I was DMing her and she just stopped replying so I'm like I asked her I said do you still want this and she didn't reply so I'm just gonna list it on Depop whoever wants it can get it it's a size medium also I'm gonna be listing my Stay Smiling hoodies well not hoodies plural just singular <laughs> this is my original copy my original one that I took pics in merch shots and all that kind of stuff and I definitely put some wear into it it has some like mild detergent stains that I can't seem to get out and so I basically just had my warehouse man send me a new one fresh and clean for myself but this medium um, like I said they're not available on the shop anymore so if you want to buy that off me then you'll have like a nice OG stay smiling hoodie all right and then just the rest of the stuff that I'm probably gonna be adding onto the shop as well is from my freaking whole entire dresser of t-shirts over there, as well as my hat collection. I have just way too many hats, way too many t-shirts. I'll be adding more to the Depop um, as I find things. So this all being said, thank you so much for helping me clean out my closet. I really appreciated that. Um, I feel like a lot of weight has been lifted off my shoulders and I know I already said that, but it's very true. And I'm perspiring as we're speaking right now. It's getting really steamy, so I'm gonna end off this video, okay? Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up for me. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. Ring the notifications bell if you wanna be notified when I upload, and until the next upload. Stay smiling. See you later. To young lovers with nothing better to do. Sit around the house, get high and watch it too.